Welcome once more to Mathematics Pro. So today we are going to calculate the height given the volume. So they gave us volume. So of this trapezoidal prism. So we are asked to calculate the height. So the first thing to do is to write the formula of volume for prism. So the formula of volume, volume is equals to base area times the height. So this is the formula of volume. So in this question, they give us the volume already. So our volume, so we can just need to substitute. So the volume will be 380. We have 380 should be equals to, we don't know the base area yet. So we need to calculate the base area so that we'll be able to calculate the height. So looking at our shape, this is a trapezoidal prism. So it means the base is a trapezium. Other words, you should know that a trapezium has two faces that are equal. And those faces that are equal is the base. Like we can see this face and this face are equal. So this is the base of the trapezium. And also we need to calculate the area of one base, not two. So the area of just one base. Okay, so let's calculate the, the base area. So this is our trapezium. So the formula of base area or the formula of area of a trapezium is equals to, we can see call it base area. Base area will be equals to base one plus base two times the height divided by two. So to get our base area, we are going to have base one. You can see that base one is seven. Seven plus base two is 13 plus 13 times the height is four times four divided by two. So our base area will be equals to, if we add these two bases together, they, uh, 7 plus 13 will give us 20 times 4 times the height divided by 2. So 20 times 4 is 80. 80 divided by 2 is 40. So now that we have the base area, we just need to block it here. Then we'll be able to calculate the height. So our base area is 40. So we have 40 times h. So 40 times h is the same as 40h, we can write it as 40h, should be equal to 380. So we have a linear equation. So to get the value of h, we need to divide by 40 on both sides, or we just divide by 40, still the same thing, so that h will be left alone. So h will be equal to 380 divided by 40. So we can simplify if we don't have a calculator. Zero and zero will cancel up. If we divide 38 divided by two, will give us 19. And four divided by two will give us two. So 19 divided by two will give us 9.5. So this is our answer, 9.5 centimeter. So hence, H for the solution, H is equals to 9.5 centimeter. Thanks for watching. Please to support my channel. Subscribe.